Okay, I thought I'd make this video. Normally I'd be in bed by this time, but um, it's only 11, 12 p.m. Uh, mountain by the time I make this video, and it's a Thursday night. On Thursdays I stay up a little late, because Friday I don't do much. But anyway, that's not what I want to talk about. What I do want to talk about is, um, I noticed recently um, when I was discovering, uh, going through the shows I was watching, I noticed Disney XD. I have Direct TV. If anyone's curious, um, and basically their channel says sign off instead of like the names of shows. Now I don't know if this is possible on any of the other providers. I mean, Dish Network might have that problem. A uh, Cable One, Xfinity, UVerse from AT and T, uh, Time Warner, which I don't know the name of their new uh, service, but just to name several. <laughs> But anyway, any of the cable providers, satellite providers you have in America, you may or may not have this problem. Even streaming, if you have like one of those uh, streaming services that has Disney XD and a guide similar to this, I don't know. I have DirecTV. This is my go-to uh, place. I wish they would pick up the Buzzer channel like what Dish Network has. Hint, hint, DirecTV. Give us Buzzer. But aside from that... Um, if anyone's curious, um, I'll go ahead and go through where uh, the whole um, sign-off ends. It ends at 4 in the morning, which is basically uh, Eastern, 6 o'clock, and in Pacific, 2 in the morning. Or no, I'm sorry, uh, 3 in the morning. <laughs> Almost got my time zones confused. I do apologize for that. Anyway... But for the other shows, um, currently Disney XD in the U.S. has Milo's Murphy Law, which is a good uh, successor to Phineas and Ferb. <coughs> the new Mickey Mouse animations, which <coughs> is a take on classic and modern, which I really like. The new DuckTales, uh, which has the 10th Doctor from Doctor Who, David Tennant. I wish Matt Smith would actually get a role in a, some animated stuff. Hasbro, if you're watching this, um, you need to get... Matt Smith and My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. I'm begging you. At least, if you want to make G5 worth watching, you need Matt Smith. Okay, that was a little off topic. But Big City Greens, which I have seen. Well, I haven't seen them before. Big Hero 6, the series. I have not seen the movie, so please don't spoil. Phineas and Ferb. Oh, that's a good one. Ultimate Spider-Man. This is probably a sign that uh, Disney XD might rebrand to um, Marvel HQ, which I hope does not happen. Of course, some people say it should happen. I say don't. Star vs. the Forces of Evil. To be fair, the first seasons were good. Well, the first two. The third one started to go downhill. And season four, I'm sorry to say, it's trash. And um, although my friend on Twitter claims that that shows the reason why uh, Wonder Over Yonder got discontinued, that's not always the case. I can't be sure if that's true. Oh, and Gravity Falls, um, the first season is always the best. Um, or I, the other seasons are meh. But, um, what? The, well, there's more sign off on here, but um, yeah. So if anyone uh, knows uh, about this, well, could this be a sign that a Disney XD could rebrand back into, or rebrand to Marvel HQ? I hope not. I mean, sure, Disney XD shut down over in Australia, and in the India it rebranded to uh, Marvel HQ. But I'm sorry to say, Mr. Ponytron, if you're watching this, I know you're a big fan of Marvel, but I think the idea of... Uh, Disney XD rebranding into Marvel HQ, it's just a recipe for disaster. You might as well... I say that kindly because at first they're going to yank off, well, the good shows like Beyblade, Pokemon, and Yokai Watch. Well, at least Pokemon, which really is a big deal to me. Yokai Watch and Beyblade are also up there as well. But to be honest, when it comes to Beyblade, I much prefer the Metal Generation with Jinka Hagane. Explain to... That's kind of explains why in my R&F series, which I haven't done in a while, um, 
If you don't know what RNF is, it's short for Ryan and Friends without using the proper name because that name is already taken. But, um, yeah. Of course, most people would say Tyson would be the man. He's up there. But, um, for other shows, Yokai Watch. I, I haven't played any of the games, sadly. I need to probably talk to, to my good friend Super Mindkip95, who also has a YouTube channel. In fact, um, I might have to ask him if he will lend me his copy of Yokai Watch so I can play it a bit. I don't know. I'll think about it. So, anyway, tell me, what do you guys think your thoughts are since uh, Disney XD pretty much has this sign off uh, stuff on screen? Is this on your cable and satellite provider? Or is this just a direct TV thing? Or is this a sign that Marvel HQ is sneaking over to America without knowing? Tell me, what are you guys' thoughts? I have no idea, so that's my video. I'm sorry I went off topic, YouTubers. I just wanted to make this video before I get too tired and uh, fall asleep and literally pass out on screen. Well, that's not going to happen, but that was a state of mind. So thanks for watching, and, um, well, good night. That's all I have to say.